Good morning, good morning, good morning. It has been, I guess, almost two weeks since I returned from my wild and fun and crazy trip out to the Grand Canyon. And I haven't been out hiking at all in that time frame. So it feels good to be out today. I'm over at Hobbs State Park here in Arkansas. And I'm on the Karst Loop Trail. And it's about an eight mile loop. If you decide to come out here and do this, it has a nice parking area. It is just a little bit of a, a keyhole hike, meaning you hike out, I don't know, maybe a thousand yards or so, and then the loop begins. And so I'm gonna go counterclockwise and see what it has to offer. Looking forward to it. I don't know if I mentioned it's eight miles. So it's gonna feel good to get out and move this morning. It really is green and lush here. So looking forward to it. The birds are just chirping this morning, singing good morning, loving it. This lake is amazing. <laughs> I jumped in and went out there. I was floating on my back, playing around, and this dad and daughter came up on their bikes and they stopped for a while and had a snack here. And they said, how is it? And I said, amazing. No, I think I said, wonderful. <laughs> and when I did, it just echoed all through here. It shocked me, it was really loud. Yikes, but it's going to be hard to leave this lake. It is so wonderful. So nice to get in a lake that's so nice and warm and pleasant. Real quick shoe foot update. On the CDT, at the end of it, I lost the second toe on toenail on this foot. And um, yesterday, I finally lost the toenail on the second toe on this foot. So hopefully, they'll get all healed up. And I'd gone to the altars for two days on the Ozark Highland Trail and 
they started falling apart, so I'm back in the hokas. And they seem to be working. Used them in the Grand Canyon. That took about three hours and 10 minutes. I'm parking lots right there. And I stopped at the lake there for about 40, 45 minutes and swam and rested and laid in the sun for a minute. It was wonderful. So cool little hike and easy terrain. Can move pretty fast on it. So was quite enjoyable. Next, I'm gonna head over to Pigeon's Roost and check that out. Karst Loop that I just finished, it's open to bike traffic and foot traffic, but I only saw the whole time six bikes and four or five hikers, that's all. So it was a pretty quiet trail, I enjoyed that. This trail is open to foot traffic only. So I'm looking forward to that, that'll be nice. And it's marked by white blazes, so it'll kind of feel like the AT. And it's about an eight-ish mile loop. And it goes to water also, a lake. I might have to take another swim. Saw the cutest tiny little tanager and he was up on this limb and I was trying to get a picture of him but he took off and when he took off he flew over to this other tree and a cardinal flew out of it and those two like flew away playing together it was really cute I've never seen anything like that before where two different species are playing I don't know what they were doing it looked like play to me it was cute another successful dunk in the lake. This trail along with the karst loop trail that I did earlier, both skirt along Beaver Lake, which is this huge lake. It's like 400 and something square miles. It's a reservoir lake that's built, that's been, is man-made from a dam of the White River. That's all I know, that's all I got. <laughs> Feels great on this hot day. about a mile and a half left but I had to jump in one more time it felt so good and refreshing
like I did about eight miles on this trail. Um, I did the Huckleberry Loop and most of the Dry Creek Loop. I think the whole thing is 8.4 and there was a little bit that I cut off because it I would have had to have backtracked it. So looks like I did eight miles. Uh, really nice trail. I had to get in the water two different times. Probably spent 30 minutes each time and it was wonderful and refreshing. This trail was rated moderate. The Karsh Loop that I did this morning was rated easy. So that's just FYI. This was nice because there was foot traffic only on this one. Happy trails!